On this RV decor video, I'm talking my top five RV decor mods. over the last two years a lot of mods to the RV things that I would consider RV decor now I wanted to give you my top five of all the things that I've done and I am gonna put these in order that's gonna be my lights around the bar and around the TV I love this one. This was a super easy and a cheap mod. It wasn't that expensive and I love the fact that, well, I can change it to any color I want. Love this and I did this at Christmas time because you could turn them to red for Christmas or green for Christmas or you can just change them for whatever mood you want. I did these originally with a different set and they ended up dying after a year so i had to redo it with this set and i think this set's going to be better than the other ones the other ones had like a silicone over the top of them and they ended up getting hot and burned out now i do try to remember to turn these off when i'm not in the rv because the other ones i pretty much left them on all the time which was probably not good i will leave links to everything in the description box below so that way, if it's something that you can buy and you're wanting it, you can find it there. Is this drop down bar area, I'm gonna call it. So this, I do have a full video that shows totally how I did it from beginning to end and I will link that up here. But this here, it gives a lot of extra counter space I don't say that we use it to sit and eat at very much, but we use it to put things down like when you come in or if we've just got something that we want to carry out the door. With this, this has turned into our staging area and it used to be over there, but now I do it over here. I absolutely love this. Super easy thing to do and it just gave us some extra space. Now, I don't know, I had a bunch of people ask and I can't remember how far the table came out so that if this slide comes in and you have a table if you can still do this I would think you can but I don't know that for sure because I haven't had the table since we even got the RV taking out the table and putting in this desk that's what I'm gonna call it and you're gonna have to excuse there's ladybugs all over the place and uh, actually ugh, <laughs> I'm gonna do a video about how to get rid of them in your RV I think if it keeps working I'm gonna give it a little bit of time so if that's kind of stuff you like hit that subscribe button so you're notified when I upload videos the first year that we were in the camper I took out the table and added this desk I love having this desk this way. I love it being able to look out in everything rather than looking to the inside. We didn't need that table. We never used the table and this just made more sense. Plus, this being this way, when the camper's closed up, we can walk through here and access the camper way better with the slide outs in than when the table was here. And also, I have a full video that shows you exactly how I built this table, and that video is up here. The only thing that I think I would have done different, and we're gonna have to modify this one, I'm sure, probably this year when we change out the couch, is I wish I hadn't have made the table as long. I'm gonna have to cut it off a little bit. It just really needs to be about two inches shorter. Pile here in the kitchen, and in the bathroom. Now, I didn't show you how I did the tile in the bathroom. I did do a video of me installing the tile here in the kitchen, and I will link that video. I love this tile. I just think that it adds such a great look to the camper, 
it just elevates it. It really brightened up this space because this was the brown wood and adding this lighter tile. And I feel like this is probably the realest looking tile that I have ever seen. I've had people think that it is real tile. Is my curtains. Now these, I, I, I had went through a transition with the curtains. I tried, I tried to keep the balances. I really thought keeping the blinds, I had to keep the balances because it wouldn't look right. So I just ripped the band-aid right off and went ahead and took them off. I don't know why I waited so long. I'll link all of the videos that I have done about the windows. There are several videos on me doing the windows. I've gone through few phases on the windows, but this one, totally my favorite. And I got curtain rods, Turkish tiles, and then the little clips and made my curtains. And I was able to keep my blinds because that was my biggest dilemma. I did not want to lose my blinds. Hope you enjoyed my top five RV decor mods. Till next time, like and subscribe.